No worries, Bobby. We'll soon get the traffic moving again. And I'll get on to the authorities about getting the traffic lights fixed. <coughs> oh. Yes, can I have... Oh. Hmm? <laughs> Just wait till Martin and Mia see you, Fluffy. They'll love you. <coughs> Whoa! Ow! Ow! Jumpy? What on earth were you thinking of? Haven't you heard of road drill? I... I wasn't... No, you weren't. Whenever you cross the road, you must stop, look and listen. Yes, I know. I'm sorry. Oh. Ow. Oh. Hmm. I think we'd better get Tina and Ted to take a look at you. Hi, Tina. Petey here. Got a little job for you. Yes? What can I do? Bobby! There's someone at the door! No, there isn't. I think someone might be playing silly games. Hmm. There you go, Jumpy. And next time, be a bit more careful when you cross the road. Yes, Ted. <laughs> oh! I almost forgot! Fluffy! Fluffy? Fluffy? Fluffy! I'm taking him to meet Martin and Mia. <laughs> bye, Ted. Bye, Tina. Thanks, Abby. <laughs> Fluffy? These are my friends, Martin and Mia. Martin and Mia meet Fluffy! He's a bit shy. Come on, Fluffy! Out you... Fluffy! He's gone! Fluffy! No! Fluffy! Where are you? Oh! When? <gasps> Maybe he escaped when I fell over in the road! Fluffy! We'd better go and help him. Yup, I think so. Yes? I know you're there, and when I catch you... He's at it again! Did you see who it was? No, Bobby. I was keeping my eye on Petey and Tiffany. They've sorted out the traffic jam. Max! Max! Whoa! Got a job for me, Bobby. I might have. Someone keeps ringing the doorbell and running away. And you want me to find them. I'm on the case, Bobby. Um... What does he look like? I don't know, do I? If I did, I'd have caught him myself. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, of course. Just a minute. I've got a brilliant idea. <laughs> got you, you little <laughs> scamp! Ringing doorbells and running away is a very serious offence, especially when you do it at a police station. But I didn't. I mean, I, I haven't. Oh, so the bell just rang by itself, did it? No. Well, I, I pushed the bell and... Uh, uh, there, there, little fellow. Uh, um... Jumpy's lost his Fluffy. His what? His new pet, Fluffy. He was coming here to ask you to help look for him. Oh, I see. Well, that's what we're here for. And what did, um, <coughs> does Fluffy look like? Well, he's all black and furry, and he's got lovely long legs and these great big eyes, and he's cute! <laughs> he's cute. It's all right, little... Oh. It's a problem, Bobby. Uh, just a bit. I, I'd like you two to go on a pet hunt. A what? Jumpy's lost his pet. He's called Fluffy. He went missing when Jumpy almost had that accident with you. Hmm. This sounds like a job for Timber. Good boy, Timber. Find! Find! Go, Timber! 
Don't worry, Jumpy. Timber will find Fluffy. Yeah. <laughs> and in the meantime, why don't you pop round to the fire station? Ask Barney and the team to keep an eye out for him. Thank you. Bye, Bobby. Bye. <laughs> and his little feet. And they're so soft. And he looks at you with those cute big eyes. And he's all black and furry. And... <laughs> oh. oh, Jumpy. <laughs> don't worry, Jumpy. We'll find him. I hope. Hi, Petey. Looking for Jumpy's little puppy? Puppy? I thought it was a kitten he'd lost. Oh! Oh, a kitten, eh? Hear that, Tom? We're looking for a kitten, not a puppy. Gotcha, Frankie. Fluffy? Fluffy? It's me, Fluffy! Oh, where are you? Poor Jumpy. I love you, Oh. Sorry, Scoot. This is going to catch the phantom doorbell ringer, Scoot. Max? What are you doing? I'm going to hide across the road in this cunningly constructed letterbox. Then, when whoever it is that's been ringing the doorbell arrives, wham! I'll have him. <laughs> Lovely! Lovely? Oh, we'll never find him. Let's go and see if Timber's had any luck. Jim. Oh. Ooh. Hello, that's new. I suppose the postal department must have put it there. Don't know why, there's one just round the corner. Still, I suppose they must know what they're doing. Better empty it, I suppose. Go away. Ooh. Who said that? I did go away. Who? Who's there? Me. Oh. I'll go away. I don't know what's going on. A talking letterbox? Think Bobby had better be told about this. It's you. Yes, it's it, it's me. I, I think. It's all right, Kimmy. I heard you the first time. <laughs> Bobby, are you all right? <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> Max, Max, you can come out. There was no mystery bell ringer. It must have been a loose connection. So. <laughs> <laughs> Sandbucket? Sorry. Uh, yep. Please. Oh, jumpy, Elfie's busy. Can't you play with your friends? <sighs> They're out on the sea sailing with their dad. Well, maybe Elfie can play later when she's off duty. But not now, OK? <sighs> OK. <sighs> what? I can't 
The way to get to Treasure Island. Is there really treasure there? Well, there's a picnic anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi, Mum. Oh, yes, fine. Really great, yes. See you later. Bye. See that inlet? We'll land there. <laughs> <laughs> Jumpy. I have to go on duty soon. That's Whoa. all right. <laughs> jump when I give the order. Aye, aye, sir. Ready? Jump! <laughs> Tie it up to that branch. Great. I'm good at knots. Be seeing it, me arties. <laughs> <laughs> wow! X marks the spot. See over there. <laughs> no, it be the spot. <laughs> we shall dig for treasure here. Martin, <gasps> Mia, quickly! <laughs> What's happened? <gasps> oh no! I thought you said you were good at knots. I'm sorry. I thought I was. It's not your fault, Martin. I should have checked it myself. Oh, well, thank goodness for mobile phone. Oh, no. Where is it? Uh, I'm sure it was in here. You gave it to me to talk to Mum, and I gave it back. Oh, must have fallen out. But it's, it's not here. And it's not in the water. Maybe you dropped it after we landed. Could be in the dinghy. So, no phone. Now what? <sighs> Sorry, Jumpy. I've got to get ready to go on duty now. OK, then. Thanks, Max. <sighs> Uh-oh. <sighs> oh. Hey, G. Max, you've got the wrong helmet. I know, I know. Jumpy's taken mine by mistake. Keep a lookout and tell me where he is, will you, so I can catch him up. I'll do my best. Raph. Receiving, G. Raph, I need your help. We're looking for Jumpy, but he's wearing Max's helmet. Oh, um, I can see Max over there. How do you know it's Max? I can tell by the helmet. It's Max's helmet. No, that's Jumpy. That's who we're looking for. Oh, good. Well, I found him then. So... Where is he? He's... he's... uh... oh. He's gone. There. It's ready. Off you go. Hey! I can see right over to the beach and the city from here. Can you see G? Yes! Get waving, then. OK! <laughs> We saw Jumpy just now near City Hall, but he's disappeared again. OK, I'll keep looking. Tell me if you see him again. Let's go, Scoot. <laughs> oh, that siren. <laughs> oh, why can't G see me? Maybe she's busy with an emergency. But we're an emergency. Oh, there he is. There's Jumpy. Do you mean you can see Jumpy or someone wearing Jumpy's helmet? Uh, I can see someone wearing Jumpy's helmet. So that's Max. Is it? Oh, I get it. Yes, that's Max. So that one must be Jumpy. Uh, Max, Jumpy's by the cafe now, on his way towards the river. Thanks, Ralph. Oh, I can see him too. He's crossing the bridge now. And he gets through two, three, four defenders, and he shoots! Oh, Jumpy, you've got my helmet. I've lost my ball. Hmm, that 
that's a job for Elfie. I'll call her up. As long as you give me back my helmet. Oh, sorry, Max. <laughs> Hooray! Max has got his helmet back. Well done, Raph. Thanks. Oh, gee, turn round, will you? Is that someone waving from the island? Um, yes. It looks like it. Oh, something's happening. It's Frankie, I think. Yes, he's going over the bridge. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Elfie. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Tom, I think there's someone on the island waving a flag. Could they be in trouble? Hmm, still no answer. I do hope they're all right. Someone's waving from the island, Tiffany. It might be a distress signal. OK, we'll go and take a look. Meet me at the pier, Max. We're going to take a trip on Bonnie. Good luck. Take care. Tiffany, look! Oh, no! Oh, someone's left a mobile in there. Martin and Mia were out with their dad. It must be his. But where are they all? I'm worried, Petey. His mobile's ringing, but he's not answering. I'm sure everything will be all right. Tiffany to Petey. We've got everyone, and they're all fine. Thanks, Tiffany. There you are. What did I say? Oh, thank goodness. Oh! <laughs> thank you all for coming to our rescue. And I promise I'll look after my phone better in the future. So it was you on the <laughs> island. Yes. Did you see me waving? Yes, but Raph saw you first. Thanks anyway, Elfie. <laughs> oh, good, you're back. There's someone to play football with at last. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Jumpy's going to love this. It'll be his best birthday party ever. I hope he's hungry. I've never seen so much food. <laughs> I hope everyone's going to be hungry. <gasps> oh, look. What? What is it? There. It's a bear. See anything? Uh, not a whisker. Uh, Bobby, hi. Listen... <laughs> I can't believe I'm telling you this, really, but we've just seen a bear outside the cafe. Well, this is the city of friends, you know. Nothing that happens here ever surprises me. Tell me about this bear. What does it look like? OK, well, it's quite small for a start, but I only saw its face. Hmm. It could have escaped from the animal park. I'll ring round as soon as I've sent out a search party. Tiffany, we have a report of a small bear on the loose what? near the cafe. Can you check it out? Will do, Bobby. Whatever next day, Petey. Beats me. <laughs> OK, Bobby, I'm on my way. Small brown bear somewhere near the cafe. Come on, Scoot. Oh, oh my. A bear cup. Hello, little bear. I wonder if it's lost or hurt or something. Are you OK, little bear? Can I come and see you? Oh, no. Ah, oh, Max! Well, that's the police for you. Always there when you need them. Hi, Kimmy. Oh, hi, Jumpy. Have you just seen a little brown bear? A bear? What, here? Just wandering about? 
It was just over there, large as life. Well, I say large as life, but the bear itself was actually quite little. More of a cub, I'd say. I talked to it very nicely, but no, it ran away. That's so cool! Mm, thing is, I'm worried, Jumpy. It might be lost or hurt or something. <gasps> so we should find it. Well, someone should find it. Bobby will know what to do. I'll go and tell him I'm going to the calf. It's on my way. Would you do that? Oh, thanks, Jumpy. I'll keep an eye out until someone comes. See you, Kimmy. Max, we've been all round there. No sign of a bear at all. Nothing that way either. I don't think there really is a bear. Oh. Hi, Bobby. Yeah, I'm at the cafe. Listen, are you sure about this bear? What? Another sighting. I'll take a look. Is Kimmy still there? OK, I'll find her. Bye. Now Kimmy's seen it. Hmm. Hey, Kimmy. Well, about time to. I came straight away. But you were here earlier and you didn't stop. I was. You shot straight past down the road there. I was on my way to the cafe to find the bear. But the bear was here. But I didn't know that, did I, Kimmy? Why don't you show me where you saw it? I saw it there. Then it went, and now I can't find it. Mm. Max to Bobby and Tiffany. What have you found, Max? Absolutely nothing. No sign of the bear at all. But Kimmy's certain she saw it. Nothing here at the cafe either, Bobby. And I've checked with the animal park. There are no bears missing. So where can it have come from? <sighs> Your guess is as good as mine, Max. The main thing is it seems to be a small bear and not dangerous. You two get back on patrol and I'll get G and Raph to keep a lookout for it. OK, Bobby. Will do. Thanks, Bobby. <sighs> You'll never guess what! You've seen a bear? No, but Kimmy has! We know! We saw it here too. It was looking through the window. Oh, let's see if we can find it! Cos I'm the bestest bear finder in the whole wide world! <laughs> yeah! Great idea! Hold on, hold on. If you do see it, you're not to get close to it. I'm sure it's harmless, but you never know. Just tell a member of the emergency services, OK? OK. No problem, Tiffany. Let's go to the park. I reckon bears like parks. Let's split up. I'll go this way and you two go that way. Then we can start from opposite sides of the park and meet up in the middle. Yeah, then we've more chance of seeing it if it spots us and runs off. See you soon, then. See you. Do you really think there's a bear on the loose in the City of Friends, G? I think it's most unlikely. Me too. Someone's probably seen a fox or something and got overexcited. <gasps> oh my goodness! What? I've seen it! I've seen the bear! No, where? There, in the park, peeping round a bush. Gee to Tiffany, I've seen the bear! <laughs> it's in the park, peeping round a bush! OK. Thanks, G. Any moment now, we should see Jumpy coming the other way. Oh, no bear, though. Oh, hi, Tiffany. Have you seen the bear? No. That's funny. G reported seeing it in the park just now. Oh, wow. So it's here. Oh, sorry. I had a bit of a problem with my bike. The bear's here somewhere, Jumpy. G saw it, but it's disappeared again as usual. OK, I know. What about up a tree? Bears like climbing trees. Good thinking, Jumpy. I'll call out the fire crew. Tiffany to Barney. Nothing up here. Well, that's the last tree. I don't think the bear's in the park after all. Let's go and look somewhere else. Oh, well, we're never going to find it. And I need to go home to get ready for my party. OK, see you later at the cafe. Good gracious me! Now I've seen it! Where, Raph? I'll tell Tiffany. <laughs> this is where Raph says he saw it. Here? <laughs> but I was here only a few minutes ago. <gasps> you don't think Raph mistook me for a bear, do you? <laughs> Ask him, Tiffany! Raph, is this what you saw? Yes! Great, you found it! 
Not exactly. You were looking at Kimmy. Oh, you're right. I could only see a bit of her. Sorry. Thanks, Raf. No problem. Well, really, do I look like a bear? Hi, Kimmy. You'll never guess what's just happened. Raf only thought that I was a... Shh. Look. <gasps> On again. <laughs> or has it? Huh? Oh? I do not believe it. Hmm. I wonder. A costume? <gasps> <gasps> this is Jumpy's. <laughs> and here's his rucksack. <laughs> Oh, it was you all along, wasn't it? You're the bear. Yes! <laughs> my mum gave me the costume for my birthday. Jumpy, but how did you manage to help us look for the bear as well as be it? <laughs> I just took the costume off quickly and stuffed it in my rucksack. And if I hadn't have got tangled up in it just now so I couldn't get away in time, you'd never even have guessed! Oh, Jumpy! Well, strictly speaking, Jumpy, I should be charging you with wasting police time. And wasting firefighters' time. And impersonating a bear. But as it's your birthday, I'll congratulate you on playing a really clever trick on us all, and we'll all have a wonderful party. <laughs> Happy birthday, Jumpy! Happy birthday! <laughs> <laughs>